Holly ho, Che Mondo here, and uh, welcome back to Jurassic Park. Uh, we're on episode two, the cavalry at today. Oh god, it's back. Diablosaurus. Well, without any further ado, let us begin the episode. I should want to start a new game. Oh, hang on. Have I got a new game? We'll go load. Try and keep our stuff from the last one, really. Oops, sorry about that. That loud bang you heard was Harley falling over. <laughs> the cavalry. <laughs> hey! Those things always look so angry. And just stare at you like that, don't they? Just flying high above the island. Never actually referenced in the movie that they were on the island, to be honest. Um. Ah, that must be the cavalry. That's it, come in a helicopter, loud noise. The storm really tore this place up. Yeah, it's a storm we're here to rescue people from, decaf. Yeah, I heard. So who did get left behind on Dino Island? Oscar, you have the list. Remind decaf what we're doing here? He slept through another briefing. Search and rescue. Biogeneticist Dr. Laura Sorkin. Genetic engineer David Banks. Park veterinarian Jerry Harding and his daughter Jessica Harding, also an unidentified woman in need of medical You mentioned a daughter? Yeah, I guess it was feed your daughter to work day or something. <laughs> then they sent me along to rescue her. Giant flesh-eating dinosaurs or Billy Yoder? I'm not sure which sounds safer. Bravo team, this is See, Avatar. the voice of the guy in the back, not the big guy, the little guy, seems very familiar. <laughs> hey, I'm no rotor head. I'd rather fast roll out of helos than fly them. Right. Listen, InGen wants us to get in, get the survivors, and get out. That's it. That's what It's we're never that easy. And apparently, Hammond wants a pair of dino skin boots bad. We have orders to take down a triceratops and skin it for him before we leave. Oh, I get it now. I'm actually here to drop your two cavemen off. Perfect sense now. <laughs> Oscar, these smell frightened baby in pilot seat. You eat. <laughs> that really doesn't sound good. Well, there's the visitor center. Four three five. I'm trying to remember that number. Probably means nothing. Oh, compies! Okay, AK forty sevens versus dinosaurs. Oh. Keep the engine running. Be ready to get us out of here. Roger. See, that's annoying me because that voice is so familiar. Oscar. It's Garza. The dinosaurs didn't take him down. It looks like he was shot to death. That's one big footprint. <laughs> Man, those are some serious trank darts. Uh, 
Do do do. That's a big hole. Did no one notice the big hole? What are we gonna do? Uh, we're gonna investigate the helicopter. Might be survivors. <laughs> Sorry. I know these films and these games. There are never survivors. Like the chopper was shot down trying to take off. Damn, Lenaris. What were you shooting at? Didn't even go for cover. Billy, get up here. Okay, we're going up there because it was gunfire. I don't know what. Get away from me, damn it! Get away! What the hell? Vargas. <laughs> what the hell did all that? That's a lot of blood. We're going in! Decaf, we're going in. Watch your ass out there. Oh, it's gonna bug me! Trust no one. Rule six, trust no one. Who was he, Gibbs? Sorry, that's a reference to NCIS. What the hell happened to you guys? It's not my fault, we couldn't see them. Only their eyes. Come on out now, Vargas. Come be! See if there's another way around. <laughs> Screwing around, Vargas. Get out of the light. They'll see you. Maybe we get to see what these things are. I said, just scare the compies. <laughs> oh. See, there's compies in those ones. Dude, you are going to have to reload soon. Come on. Stand down. That's an order. I'm sitting ducks here on the beach. We've got my shelter. What do you think you're doing, Vargas? Vargas! Found some security monitors. I can use the security cams to spot him. Talk to me, Yoder. Where is he? I can't see Vargas. See if you can get him to move. I'll get him. Okay. Fire! I need your eyes, Yoder. I can't see Vargas. It's too dark. This is quite intense, to be honest. What the hell? Yoder, I'm blind out here. Check the monitors. Can you see anything? Right side, behind the rock thing. I missed him. Why are we shooting at our own men? He's hiding. See if you can get him to move. Watching us. We got him. We got him. 
Oscar, we gotta find out what happened to Vargas. Get him some help. Forget it. He's lost. Security office. Maybe there's something on the tapes. Hang in there, Vargas. Whew. He'll be dead by the time we get back. I can see this. Security monitor over there. See if you can find anything on the videotapes. We should go. We can't just leave him like that, man. If we can find out what happened, maybe we can help him. Uh, we'll go that one. Well, I guess this camera's been down for a while. That one. All right, Bravo team couldn't have gotten here more than thirty minutes ago. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Nothing going on here. Ah, we'll go for camera two. Nothing. Well, see you come in. Is that? I'm guessing those are the hidings. So that woman just ran off with our paycheck. Oh, the guy's dead. I told you! Why they didn't take him? Run. We gotta go. Decaf, get that engine started. We're lifting off. He's dead as well. Walking, walking. Does everybody just walk here? Please, listen to me. Whoever you are, you have to take us back to the visitor center. You have no idea what you're getting into out here. I know my way. I just need you to keep us safe from these creatures. Oh, really? How am I supposed to do that? Electric fences are down. Dinosaurs have free run of the island. None of us are safe here. Do you understand that? This is InGen Rescue Team Alpha trying to reach Dr. Jerry Harding. Obviously, the visitor center was compromised. If you're still out there, we're trying to... Dad, if there's a rescue team coming, maybe we should try to leave a trail for them or something. Jess, that's enough. If we want to keep out of the way of dangerous predators, I'm going to need to know where we're headed. Norte. North? To the coast. What for? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You're hurt. Let me help you. Help me! We're going to rest here for a minute. If we're stopping, I'll need to make a fire. It'll keep the dinosaurs away. Fine. Stay where I can see you. Stay where I can see you. He's not going too far. You're in a jungle. There's lots of wood. Is there anything I can do? Stay close. <laughs> She's going for the radio. There are some fresh dino tracks here. They're small, like a chicken's. Uh, it's likely Compsognathus. I saw lots of them while we were walking. It's relatively harmless. It's nothing to worry about. Are these berries edible? I'm hungry. That plant is poisonous. A handful of those berries is enough to kill a grown man. <laughs> yeah, they look delicious. Maybe just a couple wouldn't hurt me. Yes. <laughs> They're dangerous. I just want a few. It's a weird looking plant. Hey, don't wander off. Hey, Dad, are these berries edible? Probably not. <laughs> it's best to steer clear of anything we find out here. It's, she's just hungry. She's just a young girl. Back off some, okay? Um... Are you sure you're okay? That might look pretty bad. Normally I work with animals, but I am very well trained in first aid. I'd, I'd like to go ahead and take a look at your wound again, if you'll let me. I'm fine. Look, you're gonna need it cleaned and dressed again to avoid infection. 
If you bring us back to the visitor center, I can get a hold of some antibiotics for you. You, girl. Yeah? Some of these trees have fruits that look like tiny blueberries. Bring some to me. Uh, okay. It's Jess, by the way. What? Uh, Jess. My name's Jess. Okay, Jess. Bring me the berries. They're good medicine. Talk to her, Jerry. You're kind of quiet, Dad. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll click on it. Jeez. Don't be stupid. Doing. There we go. Do you have any family? None of your business. I just thought that if you could understand how. You love your daughter, don't you? Uh, yes, of course. You'd do anything to make sure she grows up safe. Yeah, I would. Good. Then I know you'll do exactly as I say. And as long as you do that, I won't shoot her. I can tell by the way you talk to Jess. You, you have a daughter, don't you? Stop talking. Think of her, and you'll understand what I'm- I said shut up! I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I- You know nothing about me! We are not simpatico, comprende? You say another word, and I will shoot you and leave you for the scavengers! Please, just calm down, Cal I didn't- Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I won't mention it again. Please. Um, I, I drank like four diet sodas earlier, and I really have to pee, like super bad. Go, hurry. <laughs> she is good. Regular jungle crap, like trees and dirt and stuff. Everything looks the same out here. Oh, but my dad built a fire? You might be able to see the smoke if- Yo! What do you think you're doing? Um, I'm just calling my boyfriend? <coughs> it's stupido! Please, this is my fault. I don't want to kill you, but I will do it in a heartbeat if I have to, comprende? <laughs> what I have to lose is too important. <laughs> We're getting I apologize for the sound. <laughs> that is my phone going AWOL in the background. Hello? What happened? Is that them? Is that the Hardings? Yeah, it was the girl. It didn't sound good down there. The girl said they were headed north. Let's head that way and see what we can find. I don't know, Yoder. Maybe that girl was in shock, you know? I read a study you once that said... Decap, do me a favor and stop talking. Just head north. Hang on to your butt. This is it. See anything, Oscar? Looks familiar. How's that exactly? Before your time. No sign of them there. <laughs> Looks familiar. Did he used to work here or something? Did that girl say anything to you about a cliff? No. But she did say they were going north. They could have been heading for the coast. Sign of just trees. We got smoke. Woohoo! Smoke? Think they're trying to signal us? I thought we were dealing with a hostage situation. Whoa, shit, birds! Pterosaur! <laughs> Did that just drop kick the helicopter? Sorry, buddy. I'm 
Oh wow! Falling! Falling! <laughs> <laughs> we know you have a uh, great many choices when flying through dinosaur infested airspace and we thank you for choosing Yoda Airways. Yoda. <laughs> Where are we? Out. Oh man. InGen's gonna be pissed when they get the bill for this. And yeah, then they should have gotten pterodactyl insurance. Pteranodon insurance. Huh? Can you fix it? Uh, yeah. How did he know the difference? You've got an hour. I'm starting to think he did work here. He knows something about the island. There's something about him. These jungles seem different. Different from what? All jungles kind of look the same to me. Hey, you remember the? Hey, hold on. We are survivors. Maybe. But we're still pretty far away from where you spotted the fire. Or whatever it was, it's gone now. Let's move out. I smell smoke. Check it out. Close. No, I don't smell anything. Hold up. It may not be safe. I know. That's what I have this for. <laughs> Yoda just runs off. I swear he said Yoda. Oscar, definitely signs a camp. The subjects were here. Just need to pick up their trail. Right. I got some blood here. This just keeps getting better. Broken leaves, stems. If they came this way, they didn't leave a trace. No sign of a trail. No broken leaves, nothing. So, that is the only way. We've got some fresh tracks here, Oscar. I'm guessing dinos. Ah. Oh boy. I'll bet that's not gonna go over well with Mom. <laughs> oh shit! Move! <laughs> Okay, that didn't quite work. Jesus, this guy is manhandling it. Oh. Nope. This guy is really manhandling the dinosaur. Where's Oscar? <laughs> there he is. Oscar, thank God. I thought I was a goner. I told you to be careful. What the hell is that thing, anyway? Whatever it is, I'm gonna kill it. Whoa, whoa, calm down, big guy. It's over. It's over. Let it go. Look at it. You won. It's not gonna hurt anyone now. Hey, thanks. Anyway, I looked everywhere. Couldn't find any sign of a trail. That way. What was that? You realize we're headed straight towards a cliff, don't you? There's no way down from here. We're gonna have to find another way around, which will take us, I don't know, at least a half a day. There's an old goat path that will take us down. She knows the island as well. That is really peculiar. Bone shaker. What the? Oh wow! How can you tell me about any rides like this, Dad? Right. I do believe that shall be the end of this episode. Hopefully, you've enjoyed. Uh, maybe next episode we'll get to go on the roller coaster. Like, comment, and subscribe to to the channel. Hopefully, you've enjoyed it as much as I'm enjoying this. And remember, be good. And if you can't be good, don't get caught. Bye.